Hello and welcome back to Raging Loop. So apologies for the bad audio mix in the last video. I switched to a wireless set of headphones and I didn't realize that that completely reset all of my audio settings and so yeah, the resulting mix was pretty bad. So hopefully it'll be better now and we will continue. So yeah, the vote is between these two. It's definitely gonna be him. It's way too early for her to die. Probably, we'll see. Yeah. She's the better vote, though. <laughs> so, Ty and her. Oh, yeah, that was so weird. So, yeah, just before the trial last time, especially since you may not hear this if you don't stick with the bad audio in the last video, but he said that, uh,. We asked him, who do you think the wolves are? And he said, Harochan. Immediately. Then this entire freaking trial, he never once brings up that he's suspicious of her. What the hell is going on with this guy? So either maybe, it could be he's a really good player and he's just hiding it because he doesn't think he can vote her off yet and he doesn't want to be a target. But he does think he's a, she's a wolf. Or, I don't know. I mean, or he's a bad wolf and then and he just throws out that random suspicion and doesn't do anything about it. I don't know. It's really weird. I am starting to feel better about him not being a wolf, though. I'm starting to feel she really may be. But alright, let's continue. Jin-san,分かってっか? <laughs> ああ、Oh, uh, it was already evening. I whiled away the time with some fruitless contemplation. I heard noises outside that brought me back to reality. So we've been locked in the room here. I opened the window and shouted. It was facing the cliff, so I couldn't shout to the settlement directly. They probably didn't hear me, since I didn't get a response. So I shouted even louder. Oh, was I about to get punched? I can only repeat myself. It was? I didn't get a reply this time. I only heard several voices clamoring. Then I heard someone hurry up the dorm stairs. I got no response again. What was happening here? Someone was definitely close. This is weird. It just made me more tense. My voice is cut off by a scream. That was more like intense cursing. It was Takumi-san's voice, no doubt. Jamie left without saying another word. I fought the door off, but it showed no signs of opening. Shit. Like hell, I was gonna stay out of the loop any longer. Turning around, I went to the open window and decided to try and jump out. Though it was on the second floor, it wasn't too high of a drop. It made my legs a little numb, but so what? I jumped out without any hesitation. I probably bent my knees so I didn't hurt myself at all. Then I ran to the settlement where I heard the voices from. I quickly understood the cause of Takumi's shouting. They were cries of despair. The reason was somewhere downhill along the way to the graveyard. It was a small grove of low trees with a carpet of leaf mold below. It would have been hard to see even if there was no mist. You could hear running water nearby. I couldn't see where it come from, but it was probably an irrigation channel for the paddy fields. There was a small crowd gathered, and I peeked through a space between them. 
there were bodies. Two of them. One was of an old man and the other that of a child. Though their appearances were vastly different, each was in a similar state. They lay on the ground with their hands over their stomachs, utterly still and covered in blood. These are the corpses of the old man who cried wolf and mochi. なぜ何がまったくそいし。さっきまで。そつけ。目がやったんだろ。あ、シャラ。違いますよ。本当にさっきまで寮の部屋にいたんです。ちえ。うん。ハルアキ。じゃあ誰がや。そんなことより。無
group, this group left and maybe split up and then one of them immediately went and killed him. But I don't know. In 10 minutes. We then went to the hall. Kianosuke kept watching and confirmed that no one besides the victims and the search party had left the building. Okay, so this is our potential killer group, really? I mean, I'm suspicious of Chiami, really. Although I don't know why they would do this now. Like, it's so weird. Unless this is part of the game? Like, like uh, the killing Mochi to get a free kill? Is that allowed? I don't think it's Takumi. I mean, I don't think it's Rakaku. I guess Yasunaga, that's the other suspect. Chiami or him? I limited the potential murderers to the search party and I. I asserted that I was still in the room when it all happened and they believe me for now. Though Takumi continued to suspect that I used some sort of trick to escape and commit the murders. Well, that was fair considering everyone else was with them, but I knew it wasn't the culprit. They left only one possibility. <laughs> No. だから。そこについては僕は無実を主張し続けます。さっきから慎重に気づいた。そう。今のところ自殺や病死、毒殺の後、そんなことをして笑われに何の得がある。それよりセリゾワと貴様が共犯だとなれば、わかりませんが、
And then the outer wolf not wanting to die alone would reveal the partner. What? I don't think that's how it works either. Maybe. Huh. That was the most opt optimistic way to look at it. And yeah, for sure not in a mystery way. <laughs> From a pe pessimistic standpoint, though, the situation was absolutely terrible. Four people have died today in a normal feast of the Yomi Purge. They had to be one per day, one per night. This was double that. If things hadn't gone so well in the forest, even Haro may have been dead. Not to mention the dreadful state Kaori was in. I was told their relationship had gotten worse. Kaori was in no state to prepare food. So it was likely that no one had eaten anything today. The hunger would only worsen everyone's morale. It was best for them to prioritize getting a proper meal tomorrow. Even so, there was no guarantee we wouldn't get any more regular deaths. For example, someone at their wit's end could attack a wolf suspect despite the threat of corruption. If they ended up losing more humans while the number of wolves stayed the same, the humans would be done for either tomorrow or the day after. Escape. I've been entertaining the idea ever since lunch. The path was ruined and I'd have to travel through an underdeveloped grove. But I hadn't run into anything supernatural there when searching for Harajan. Maybe I can get out as long as I watch where I was going? I also had Saranaga as another option. Everyone here hated it, but that just made it less likely for me to be caught. Are we gonna get a choice? Going down a misty rocky cliff was dangerous, but at least it was a one-way road. I just had to be careful I didn't get taken in by the currents. It was definitely better than just staying here and dying. However, perhaps even suggesting that was dangerous. According to Rukaku, the effects of the corruption were limited to the one who broke the laws, so you could escape them by killing yourself. However, someone said they wanted to escape the village. The punishment would likely go both to the one attempting it as well as the one allowing it. Escape would surely become a hell of an experience then. However, there was an optimistic view of this situation. Something was actually here. Something abnormal here was in Yazumizu, killing and menacing its people using abnormal methods. At the very least, <laughs> punk kid who went to face it suffered a horrible death. The superstitions weren't baseless, and it was best to look at the situation from that angle. My plan of escape contradicted that. But then how could I prepare for whatever was to come? The best I could think of was trying to familiarize myself with Yoshi's superstitions. Fuji Yoshi's. Perhaps I could find some sort of weak point or hint that could lead me to their identity? The actual rap they did was obviously referring to the Feast of the Yomi Purge. I couldn't remember all the lyrics, but I felt like there was quite a lot of info there. Perhaps there were more hints for the feast in Yazumizu's culture and general area. I felt I had to talk to Wakako. She was an adult who seemed more involved in Fujiyoshi's prayers and, the, and stuff the most. I need to arm myself with more info by tomorrow morning. That, along with the proper progression of the feast, were my only ways to survive. About today's feast. They must have decided to hang the wolf guy because they just, they just didn't care about him all that much. Simple as that. Sure, it was important to get rid of the participants who weren't cooperative. However, the fact that we'd lost six people, but they still hadn't gone beyond, he or she is kind of shady, it was pretty bad. Yesterday, they wouldn't have hung anyone for such a petty reason. Well, the problem was that they hadn't hung anyone at all so far. But then again, it wouldn't be a good thing to give the impression that it was okay to kill people just for seem seeming shady. The place was regressing back to a feudal, superstitious mental state. If there was something that could stop them from sinking there, it would be an outsider like me. I steeled my resolve and waited for the night to pass. I was so startled by the voice on the other side of the door that I was momentarily screamed. What time was it? Seven? It was too early for an attack and too late to walk around. ゆきまいにちねすぎでしてね。備蓄は。うーん。香織さんがあんなみんな今日はお腹空かせてるしね。ハロアキさん。いや。なんで猿のことを言ったから。うん。読み意味の宴は非常によくできたコミュニケーション
これに勝つには人猿もその一つだ何の役に立つか分かりづらいけど実はいきなり用意して2名も減らせるわけだこれは1日目から可能だから猿は安全なリーダーになれるそうだね自由人とお子様じゃな一方で狼はどちらかといえば怪しいだけでくくられる状況下ではあくまで怪しまれないそうだね黙ってても雄弁でもそうだねただごく初期のだそれが猿のああ要は間違った言うことだ。Thank you! 有用な提言をしないことだ。ちなみに、you've been really bad in this regard. 間違った誘導については、例えば、間違った計算でみんなを煙に巻いた清之助氏あたりは結構怪しい。Wait, hold on a second, I'm not sure which person that is. Uh, what? So that's the punk kid? Hold on.、Mm, no, that is. Huh. Is that the. No, that's not, that's not the thing I'm thinking of. Oh! No, so that's, that's the glasses guy. I. Wait, what? But he was cleared. Maybe it's not him. Oh, wow. Alright. l l So he hasn't been in these meetings, but I think he's being, using really bad strategy now. There's no reason. There's no reason that he would lie about that. Probably. <laughs> no, I don't think he would be a villager trying to do a fake reveal. I don't think so. That. I don't know. To take the kill away from somebody else, but I don't think so. It's not a wolf. It would be the dumbest thing in the world for a wolf to do. Why would he be lying about that? Like, he's just lying about being a villager. ハルアキさんのその意図を見抜いて黙ってるのを諦めたのかもよ。おお。というか、ということは、サルのことを教えてくれた時点では、チエミのことを見抜いて黙ってたのかもよ。おお。ということは、サルのことを教えてくれた時点では、チエミのことを見抜いて黙ってたのかもよ。おお。ああ、気づいた。なんつう男、こう。信じたかったから、かまか。回復。ということは、一番怪しいのは誰？ハルちゃん。やっぱりか。She's up there。さすがにちょっと説明になってないし、二日目で態度が、あるいは他の狼の。あ、確かにありそう。You could make up a thousand reasons like this, though. We couldn't go by just that. It said Harachan hadn't gathered many votes, but they treated her like some kind of pariah, making it clear that everyone suspected her. It was only natural to use the snake to check on her. Ma, Kanojo has so many games to cut to Kuja Nasa Kara. You yona Tayan was snake. Yeah, no games for the hand down, Sudano, a Kawai Soda Kido. For almost everyone. So did you not a Yasnaga Kun. Thank you. I said that from the beginning. And is that the same guy? Is it who they were talking about before? No. Yeah. This is my first freaking read. Although it's starting to go down now. ヤス君いっぱいいるそれに今春秋さんが言ったようなことも言ってそれに初日雲が隠れてた方がいいってこともそうなんだよね。Yeah. He's definitely contributing to the game. The first day was especially important, but all he did is give bad advice the first day. <laughs> for the wolves, it was best to create a flow where they could just stay quiet and wait for those with guardians to help themselves. 
what bothered me was the fact that he wasn't the one who brought up the leader selection in the monkey thing. It was shady because he hadn't made those useful, useful propositions. I thought he'd figure those things out a while ago. Or maybe I, as an outsider, just had a better grasp of the situation? But if you looked at the circumstances outside of the feast, Rukaku was pretty shady. It always felt like she was hinting at something. It wouldn't have surprised me if she knew more than she let on. Oh, I, de I definitely feel that. If she was a village head, she could know things from Kamafuji Yoshi. Only those from Kamafuji knew. <laughs> There was more than enough reason to suspect her. If only we could follow that lead and solve this whole thing and make things way easier. Oh, I forgot we also have Haru in her name. <laughs> I was thinking Haru is Haru chan. それは私も普通じゃないですし。そういえば人を殺しかけたとか聞いたけど。なるほど。正義の武闘派ってわけだ。so she was sent to Yazumizu for making enemies out of the village heads. Well, there was no doubt that Yazumizu was destitute. There were no cars, cell phones, and didn't feel like it hit the economy. They probably lived mostly off of land, making money from whatever they could spare from their far their farms and hunts. Since they had no decent way to sell stuff to anyone outside, most of the business had to be done through Kamifuji Yoshi. It was entirely likely they were ripping them off. No way this place could be seen wealth could be wealthy in those circumstances. And okay, I'm gonna end this video here. So, till next time.